Alrighty, so I hadn't planned on doing the uh, hookup for the propane this soon, uh, but we have uh, a hurricane headed this way and uh, decided to go ahead and get uh, everything hooked up. And uh, if we do have a power outage that lasts more than several hours, then I'll uh, go ahead and run on propane, but everything will be hooked up, tuned, and ready to go. So we have the only thing that's left today is to uh, actually. Uh, install the hose to the propane tank. So we have the hose, and the various connectors, flow valves, and of course propane tanks. So we're going to take care of that, get everything hooked up, and uh, we'll be right back. Okay, so I have my propane tanks hooked up. I have two uh, 20 pound tanks. I plan on uh, eventually moving up to two 30 pound tanks, uh, but for this size engine, uh, U.S. Carb recommends uh, uh, TN two tanks together to make sure you have enough pressure and uh, fuel, propane fuel available at all times. But I'll tee off to the uh, regulator and the hose routes, runs underneath the generator, connects to the green flow valve, which in turn connects to the regulator. So now I'm just going to uh, route the lines from the regulator to the carb and then we'll give her a start and get her tuned up. So here we are running on propane. Couldn't record and uh, get it started at the same time without a tripod. But very easy to do. The instructions were very clear. Uh, made it very easy to start on the first try. Very happy with it so far.